A sheriff forced to move on after choosing to move out. A day after Jacksonville Sheriff Mike Williams announced his retirement, shockwaves are still reverberating. Supporters and detractors alike stunned by the rapid turn of events just a week after revelations that he no longer lived in Duval County as required by law. Tonight, First Coast News is tracking fallout to this unprecedented situation both in and outside the agency. On your sides, Ann Schindler joins us live in the newsroom now. Ann? Well, Heather, this story is moving so quickly. Some folks are struggling just to keep up. But as the reality sets in, some hard feelings are too. The one thing that law enforcement you have to have is stability and consistency. And right now, you don't have any of that. First Coast News crime and safety analyst Mark Bachman says there's a shared mood from beat officers all the way up to command staff. I don't think it's anger. I've heard the word disappointed directly. That felt more keenly because of Mike Williams' reputation. Always do the right thing. That was his motto. And maybe that's coming into question a little bit right now. It's not only disappointing, but it's, I think, in the eyes of a lot of people, a significant betrayal of trust. Former Florida Bar President Hank Cox says he's as much baffled as disappointed. Personally, I like him, and I've always admired him. It's just, I guess, like most of this is really hard to figure out. He thinks Williams' year-plus vacancy raises a tangle of potential issues. Disciplined officers, people who've been arrested, contracts entered into, salaries are taken and appointments made by the sheriff of senior people in his department. Are they void? Administrative issues aside, Cox says Williams needs to answer to Jacksonville citizens. Not having him address the public and answer questions publicly and say, well, here's what happened, here's why I did it, I think is a... Uh, he took the money for the position. At least he owes that to the public. Ann Schindler, First Coast News, on your side.